Hi friends, this is Mohammed Gibran and welcome to our C Sharp tutorials. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you or explain you about the comments. So, what are comments? Comments are uh, very useful when for your programming. Suppose um, I've written this code and I have left that a particular company, and someone, uh, a new person comes and he tries to edit or to uh, modify my code. So I would like him to know what I was trying to do in this particular line or in a particular method. So for that I will leave some notes for him. So that notes can be uh, written in the program by typing the forward slashes two times. Okay, uh, there I can write whatever I would like to tell that uh, programmer. Like uh, this line prints the hello world okay so whenever the <coughs> next program come a uh, programmer comes and uh, uh, sees this uh, comment he will understand what does this line do okay so he do not he don't uh, need to worry about like what he should do with this line or what does this line does he can just read out this comment and he will understand what does this line stands for and uh, I can even comment out the code if I wish I just need to do the two forward slashes which I did previously and it will comment at the code actually commenting out means the compiler will ignore the upcoming words or upcoming characters after that comment uh, symbol okay whenever the compiler sees the two these two forward slashes it will ignore the next uh, text after it and uh, you can do that in many ways yeah, either you can just put two lines or the forward slashes in front of that or you can just select the number of lines which you want to comment out and you can go up and uh, you can just comment out the selected lines by clicking over here or you can just do control e and c just click that and it will comment out it for you and uh, if you want to remove it you can do it just by removing them or deleting them or you can do it again by selecting all of them and you can uncomment them by clicking them or just uh, pressing ctrl e and u so this will be out and uh, there is one more way to comment that is multiple line comments what i have shown you is just a single line comment and now this one will be a multi-line comment so to have a multi-line comment you will need a forward slash followed with an asterisk and uh, when you want to close this uh, area or when you want to end that comment you need again a uh, uh, asterisk and then a forward slash now this will end up that comment box okay now this block will be commented out if we run our application now nothing will happen as we have commented out everything and again if we just want to remove it you can just remove them and uh, you will have your uh, code back on the code <coughs> and now I would like to uh, explain you about the IntelliSense so what is IntelliSense IntelliSense is something which is uh, this okay which uh, gives me the suggestions what to what to write uh, you can see I have just typed con and it gives me the whole list of the keywords or the uh, supposed word which I would uh, be typing according to my visual studios which he thinks I would like to type uh, suppose I want to type console so after that I will write s o and you can see my it filters away my results okay so I can just go and click over that I can enter I can press space whatever I want after that if I press the period it will again st it start giving me the options which I can use from that okay so the intelligence is um, very useful and uh, once I have told you not to be worried about the uh, the grammar or the syntax that much because you know the intelligence will handle everything for you uh, suppose if I was uh, if I wanted to line write the right line and I am you can see my W is the lower case and I will again write my L in the lower case and uh, it shows me only one thing that is right line and I will uh, hit the enter so as you can see my right line with lowercase w and lowercase l has been changed to the right line with the uppercase w and l so this is how 
my intelligence will uh, make my r work easy and uh, one more thing it does is you can see this uh, small help window over here it sh shows me or it gives me a brief help about this method or whatever keyword is written over there uh, it just went away now let me just read it out for you it says it writes the text representation of the specified arrays of objects followed by the current line terminator to the standard output stream using the specified format uh, it might not make a big difference for you or it not made a sense for you but uh, you can understand what uh, is the difference between a right line and right once you get used to this language okay it gives you a uh, help for um, all of the words or all of the um, filters or the results which she thinks you might want to add in your code so intellisense is a very powerful tool it will uh, make your life a lot much easier so that was this uh, that's what that was it sorry for that that was it for this video i uh, hope you understood the video and thanks for watching it